join us on this roller coaster ride through the unbelievable driving mistakes. So, let's embark on a journey teeming with surprises, twists, and a healthy dose of head shaking disbelief. This video is made for educational purposes and contains significant original text commentary. Never stop on the railroad tracks, even if traffic is backed up. If your vehicle stalls or stops for any reason, evacuate immediately and get away from the vehicle. No one was injured in this case. Oh my, why speed reducers are not placed at every turning? Some simple solutions will fix this zone. Thankfully, this driver is safe. Bravo! Amazing reflexes and avoidance skills by the truck driver. Be careful on snow roads, guys. This video is the reason you really need to invest in a dash cam. Alert the unexpected man. That's black ice. Luckily, he is fine. This is a similar case. He's okay. Well, at least he quickly swerved and avoided a catastrophe. No one got hurt in this case. Whoops. When the traffic in front suddenly stops, it is best to drive defensively. Don't just tailgate to the car in front of you and drive. <laughs> Is there any way to stop that from happening? Let's share your knowledge with everyone. What is wrong with people nowadays? They just drive off like nothing happened. Don't do that, bro. What? He doesn't look in mirrors at all. Stay alert, man. Who is at fault? Let me know your opinion in the comments below. looks like a blind spot. Fortunately, nobody was seriously injured. Let's like and subscribe so that you don't miss any of our next videos, guys. If you enjoy our videos, leave a comment below with a number one. Wow, that is so close. Luckily, there were no injuries. When a vehicle turns, a centrifugal force is exerted on it, pushing it away from the center of the curve. The speed of the vehicle directly influences the strength of this force. Slow down, man. After a chase hit speeds of 145 miles per hour, a woman was seen on a dash cam video running from police. Then she was arrested and charged with a DUI. Oh dear, what a nightmare! Luckily, these guys avoided being involved by stopping in time.
it's a pretty nice Volvo and BMW. At least no one was hurt. Bravo! A professional driver. Well done, mate. Good thing all of them are fine. I believe I've talked about this enough. Keep a safe distance, please. No, don't do that, bro. Until the cops arrive, remain at the site. No way, stay in your lane. Ah, oh, careless. I have no words. I have to watch this like five times. How does someone whack a trailer like that? Oh, turn your head to check blind spots before changing lanes, man. Be particularly cautious around larger vehicles, such as trucks. Oh dear, this truck tried to go through an 11 foot underpass. Only problem was, the trailer was 14 feet. My dad drives trucks like that, and when the wind is even questionable, it's really best to stop. Hmm, did folks see this every day in January? Hope he can get out of that parking lot soon. Wow, I really need those dash cams. Refrain from overtaking other vehicles within the tunnel. Ensure that all your vehicle lights, including brake lights and turn signals, are in working order. Anyway, it's good that no one was hurt. Go fast in straight lines, but take your time on curves and turns. Don't take curves or turns too fast in a semi-truck, folks. Driver 1 shouldn't have stopped there, obviously, but also, how did Driver 2 not see them? Pay more attention, guys. <laughs> Be attentive to warning signs of instability, such as swaying or leaning. If you notice any unusual behavior, reduce speed and assess the situation before continuing. Oops, at least nobody got hurt in this case.
Do not imitate this if you don't want fines or even license suspensions. Stay alert, guys. Oh my, glad no one was injured in this situation. Whoops, the good thing is they have a dash cam. You should be more cautious than someone not pulling a trailer. If you witness or are involved in a hit and run, cooperate fully with law enforcement. I can't believe you got a driver's license. Patience is key to safe driving. Don't cut other vehicles off to save a few seconds. Oh dear, at least nobody was injured in this situation. No, mate, don't do that. Red lights are stop signs, remember. And this is the same case. The Iranian backed militants instigated the airstrike. Do not imitate this. Bravo. That was such a quick reaction. Good job with the evasive maneuvers. Wait until you have a clear view of both directions and there are no trains approaching before proceeding over the tracks. Thankfully, the driver's okay. And this is a similar case. Especially in tunnels, maintain a safe and sufficient following distance to accommodate sudden speed reductions or being at the end of traffic jams. Don't do that. Check weather and road condition updates before your journey. Be aware of any advisories or warnings. Hope they are fine. Fortunately, the driver was able to escape on his own and no pedestrians were involved. Whoops! This is why you can't lane split so fast. Man. Luckily, he's okay. Good, but... Take care a lot, guys. Thankfully, he is fine. Slowing down ensures that you adhere to posted speed limits in and around intersections. And don't forget to use the winter tires for snow roads. Whoops, light turned green. Oh. Looks like they both should have been stopped. Oh. oh, okay, Garmin. Save video. Man, slow down. If you notice the vehicle is tailgating you, consider changing lanes or pulling over to allow them to pass. Mm. Normal traffic was restored after 10 hours. Hope the driver's all right. If your vehicle has a low gear setting, use it when driving in snow. This can provide better traction and control. Serious question, why was the truck driver speeding around the corner like that? Hopefully he's learned his lesson.
No, bro, don't do that. Steer smoothly and gradually through the curve to maintain control and prevent the truck from tipping over. Well, excellent pit maneuver. Good job, cops. Oof, I hope he gave this to the cops or insurance. That was a stale red light run. Zero excuses. Suddenly, an unknown object flew out from the bottom of a truck on the right front. Kudos, the driver continued to drive calmly. Wow, be safe out there. Things are weird. Looks like he got a gas pump there. How could he forget the gas pump still on the vehicle? If towing a trailer or another vehicle, ensure that the load is properly distributed within the recommended weight limits. Don't tail me like that, mate. Give yourself a safety zone. Trains are equipped with loud horns for a reason. Listen for the distant sound of a train horn, especially when you are near a crossing rail. And this is a similar case. We have a lesson here. Approach unsignalized intersections with caution. Yield to oncoming traffic as needed. When a traffic light is not working, priority signs are important. Obey traffic signs, everyone. <laughs> Folks, regularly check and, if necessary, align and balance your tires. Address any issues promptly and don't ignore the importance of a spare tire. When driving on wet roads, exercise caution. He's okay. Good job, Ryder. Good speed, good braking. This is why you conduct routine inspections of all tires, checking for signs of wear, bulges, or cuts. Regular maintenance can identify potential issues before they lead to a blowout. Oops, I feel like he was asleep at the wheel and suddenly woke up. You can stop every two hours or 100 miles to rest and stretch. What a nightmare. Pray that all of them are all right. This is why we need a dash cam, and always be careful at intersections, folks. Oh wow, how lucky the van is! Use tarps, cargo nets, or other coverings for loose things to keep them from flying off while being transported. This is especially important for lightweight items that may be airborne at higher speeds. Oh my! Fortunately, nobody was out and about at that moment.
Fatty's all right. Stuff in the road is no joke. Man, what are you doing? Don't do that. Good job, guys. Kudos for driving defensively. Ugh. They drive like the rules don't apply to them. If you need to use your phone, find a safe place to pull over before doing so. You can focus on your phone without endangering others. Whoa! Well, let's learn how to drive, bro. This is why I think bollards are necessary infrastructure. Glad everyone is fine. Ugh, maybe someone mistook the brake and accelerator pedals. Don't try to run the yellow light and yield to each other, everyone. Oops, maybe he's drunk. Don't drink and drive, folks. No, bro. He seems to have lost his concentration. Avoid letting your mind wander or getting lost in thoughts. Oh dear. I agree with compulsory retesting when people reach a certain age. I hope the officer quickly apprehends the suspect. Oops. Glad he's okay. Always consider the clearance space when approaching railroad crossings to ensure the entire vehicle can cross safely without any part getting caught. Oh, luckily no one was hurt. How did he not see the truck coming? Stay focused on the road and avoid distractions such as texting, phone calls, or adjusting navigation systems. Always be aware of the height, width, and length of your truck, including any cargo. This is the same case. Who is wrong in this situation? Let me know your opinion in the comments. Oops, I hope there isn't much damage to the motorcycle. At least no one was hurt. Oh my god, glad he's fine. Ah, the biggest mistake people make at busy intersections. Just wait for the next cycle unless you can make the turn safely and with certainty. Ah, stop driving too fast in the rain. Just slow it down, everyone. It's better to be a bit late than break up in the wet. Dang. Try to avoid driving through standing water or large puddles. 
If this is unavoidable, slow down and drive through at a controlled speed. Oh no, this is why regular vehicle maintenance is crucial for the longevity, performance, and safety of your vehicle. That's why we don't blindly swerve to avoid a collision. Oh dear, even though it's a highway split, this one is not even that bad of an exit to miss either. How could he not see that car? Everyone pay attention when driving. Oops, be careful at intersections, folks. Does he really not know what's going on? Hopefully he's driving to the shop to get new tires. Oh, it seems like he overcorrected. Be alert when in parking lots. Pay attention to the lights of vehicles backing up. Bro, don't do that. Be a responsible driver. Wow, thankfully there were no injuries and no collisions. Well, perhaps he took a left turn too wide. Be careful, man. Ugh, what is going on? Glad everyone is safe. Cement mixer trucks have a high center of gravity due to the rotating drum. Be mindful of this and avoid making abrupt or sharp turns that can destabilize it. Hmm, I think this intersection requires a stop signal. I think in this case it is necessary to keep a safe distance instead of blaming anyone who is wrong. What is he doing? Do not imitate this. Oh, if you manage a fleet of trucks, ensure that your drivers are educated on railroad crossing safety. Exercise increased caution at uncontrolled railroad crossings. Slow down, look both ways, and listen for approaching trains. Pray that all of them are fine. Stay alert, folks. Well, minimize the use of brakes within the curve. Hard braking during a curve can lead to loss of control. Instead, control your speed before entering the curve. Invest in high-quality, durable tires that are suitable for the type of driving you do. 
cheap or worn out tires are more prone to blowouts, and investing in quality tires can enhance overall safety. Bro, make steering movements smoothly and avoid sudden or sharp turns. Abrupt steering can lead to loss of traction and result in skidding. It was a really wet day. Glad he's fine. Oops, thankfully there were no injuries. <laughs> Keep a safe distance from trucks like this. Stay away from them, everyone. Oh no, he did not notice that the traffic in front of him is stopped and reacts too late. At least there were no injuries. Oops, be aware of the height, width, and length of your truck, including any cargo. This is a pursuit that involved the suspect stealing multiple cars. No one was hurt. Running towards the freeway. Head on into a I always wear seatbelts all the time. I don't allow people in my car unless they wear one. Wow, how lucky are they? Always yield the right of way to oncoming traffic when making an unprotected left turn. Even if you have a green light, ensure that the way is clear before proceeding. Stay informed about road conditions, especially if you are driving in mountainous or challenging terrains. Be cautious of sharp curves. Oh my, thankfully there were no collisions. Man, don't do that anymore. Road signs should be closely observed, particularly those that indicate bridge clearances. If there is a low clearance sign, stay on the designated diversion route and try not to cross the bridge. What is he doing? How did he get this driver's license? Who is at fault in this situation? You decide. Slow down, guys. Yeek! Yielding to each other is a good idea, trust me. Okay, Garmin, save video. Oops! Maintaining a safe distance can prevent chain reactions. Having enough space allows you to stop gradually. Thank you for watching videos from start to finish. Share your favorite moment in the comments below. If you've enjoyed this video, please show your appreciation by hitting the like button and subscribing to our channel. See you next video!